What's up guys, this is the Rifleman and I am back to bring you to the next next episode of my Empire Total War Let's Play as Louisiana. So to pick up where we left off, uh, we are intercepting these two Austrian stacks near Prague and we do not have defences to uh, really protect us. So what we're going to do is make sure we have some good infantry uh, coming in in the event that we die horribly. And so that we're not left too far um, in the lurch if this army gets destroyed. Um, I do have, I have a good feeling about this, but let's let's find out. Um, fundamentally, we're going to have to do this, even if we don't necessarily win near Prague. We've got to uh, keep not keep pushing the Austrians back and preventing them from building up to allow our forces in the west, which are now dominant, to sweep in and uh, make their way east so we've got we've got uh, we've taken Brussels we're pushing onwards to Strasbourg Cologne uh, through southern Germany so I like this hill for a defensive position we're gonna likely need um, we're gonna likely need to do a bit of redeploying I might even. So, from memory, one should come in from. We should be wor having to worry more about our at uh, this our right flank than our left. So let's take these three line infantry units, and they can deploy. We've got grenadiers as a reserve with the line with some um, skirmishes cavalry on each flank and a whole bucket load of howitzers that are going to be firing at will so I don't know where their reinforcements are coming in from all my how it says that can't engage. Switch to round shot. we will be curious to see where they do come in. It's quite a nice little defensive position, really. Horse Grenadier Guards are getting there. Getting pasted. Let's take this unit of grenadiers and get them over onto the flank so these guys are probably going to be better use on the left flank good that's one unit of grenadier gu horse grenadier guards routed you attack those infantrymen you attack those fusiliers you attack those line infantry guards we may end up peeling this line down and kind of taking a position here, but I very much do want to see where the enemy come in from. Aha! Skirmish Warband. You require a artillery unit to engage. These Hungarian Hussars will likely get shot down. Well, they are getting shot down, but they might. That might cause them to flee. Actually, I may. Well, depending on how far those warbands go. If they walk march within range, I might just let them. Okay, right, yeah, I thought not. Get my heavy cavalry down to knock out the warband. So the, you guys focus on those dragoons. You guys focus on those units of marines coming in. Knock out the warband. 
got more regulars coming in. There goes the horse grenadier guards, they came back. Knock out the warband, go straight onto the Pandora. Pandora, Pandora. Yeah, they're coming in from the, that flank, which is what I thought they would. I might actually put one of these grenadier guards out here. Colonial lights up on the hill. Their, how their, fus their fusilier is starting to uh, not want to be uh, cut down by my cavalry. Can you guys canister shot? She canister shot the 15th regiment. Good hits. Get my heavy, heavy cavalry back. Switch to canister shot for the marines because they will be within range fairly soon. Howitz is still coming in. Okay, that unit of dragoons is gone, so focus on the 15th. Okay, I'm going to get you guys over here, because what we can do is take these infantry units, curl the flank around and begin to push on the left. Yeah, there we go. The marines are going to enter range. So you men are going to hit. Those marines. Cavalry coming in from the right flank to be wary of. Cuirassiers move up because you've still got fusiliers out there. So let's begin to push back the Deutschmeister regiment. Quickly, I'm still smashing those cavalrymen. Okay, you hit those horse grenadier guards. Good hit on the Fusiliers. Well, let's put my cavalry close to the Fusiliers. Everyone else will be able to engage the infantry in the manner we want. Makes get our, get our um, artillery focusing on the true villains. You men focus on the Fusiliers. You guys slightly rotate. Let's put these grenadiers in square on the flank on the left. You guys go hit the fusiliers because they've deployed their stakes. Those men should engage the pan the irregulars. Good. So that means at this flank can do oh, yeah, the cavalry. They're coming in. Keep winning there. Yeah, gunners have had enough. Hey, those those lancers smashed my square. Keep our howitzers firing. Understandable if our this infantry carry on fighting. Just engage to hold them up while we make our way 
through the enemy here. It's a horse guard regiment. That's not great. Bring our colonial lights through to the centre. Who are you fighting? Horse guards. Drop into square. So you can get up into position up here. Fusiliers are down. That's what we wanted to see. Okay, so quick line. Focus on the hussars coming in. No, too late. I've already accidentally limbered them up. You guys smash those fusiliers. Horse guards are down. Push the left. Heavy cavalry is right straight in. We've managed to knock back their cavalry just from quick fire, quick line alone. Let's just be all focus on those regulars that's not hit the cavalry because they're not going to fire before the cavalry are within range. You guys hit the infantry there. Okay, so now we have infantry unit that can push. You guys drop into square as well. So these men push up to create a new line. Bit of friendly fire against the grenadiers. Swiss grenadiers are down. Okay, good stuff. Yeah, they're a bit stuck because they found out that they've not got any. Um, actual way to attack us. We're going to want to push up to this ridge line to take the battle to their infantry. Get all our, cav our quick line engaging them from a long way off. Okay, good. So let's push you guys up to this line, you guys push up to here. Keep our cavalry close. Switch to round sharp. Begin engaging the 46th, and this is the second army coming in, less their initial cavalry wave. So we've got foot guards, Hungarian fusiliers. To be honest, because they are now already so close to the right position. No, you men can walk up in as a reserve. Run the skirmishes up. To be honest, the gunners are never going to get there in time. Lots of long artillery shots coming in. Lots of elite infantry as well. So we don't really want to get too caught out on the hop. But at the same time, we don't want to... Uh, 
We don't want them to mass. We can put a lot of firepower into the mix, so we want... We want to get that firepower off. So we want these guys to... There we go, to pour fire into the 46th. Those guards are routed. Okay, let's get my crossier into the mix. Probably get my lights over on this flank as well. Now we know that's where they're going to route to. All my Howies engage the Hungarian line. Fusiliers, Gailani. The Hungarian line have been broken. Okay, so howitzers, limber up. You guys get back to manning your guns. Twenty ninth foot guards are getting a bit upset. Do they have fire at will? Fire by rank? They do. Okay, right. You guys need to do something more like this. Push them up. Now this infantry is probably going to be placed here with some skirmishes in support. So if you men can break these marines, that would be great. These grenadiers would probably do very well in that regard. Yeah, they're going to go down. Fusiliers and the Gulai Gul Regiment. You guys fire at will, because you currently are not. Pour fire into that block of troops. You guys don't really have a great firing position, but you might if you stay firing round shot. Dropped some stakes in. Oh, I got a whole bunch of cavalry coming in. If you guys can knock out the fusiliers, at the very least, once I've got my formation of howitzers set up, we can retreat if needs be so they've poured fire into those hungarian line run my light cavalry round through the woods okay so let's move our line up aggressively let's move my cavalry over to the right my howitzers are all in line. Quick line is still a bit far, but... So you're going to knock out those foot guards. So who are you? Horse Grenadier Guards. 
hit the horse grenadier guards because they're bigger. Hit our light cavalry to the rear. Those light horse are probably going to take us out. Okay, I think. Using our light cavalry as decoys. Especially as you guys are being hit in the flank now. You guys fall back. So those guys, this line infantry is going to drop into square. But they're going to get hit by this formation. So at least here we can then decide we're going to use the guns. Everything going. You guys engage the Y, the V, the regiment, the VA, the regiment, however it is pronounced. Because we did overextend. My howitzers need to focus on the right flank. Or at least let's drop two of them on there. My cuirassiers are going to hold off. We'll hold on for a while. These grenadiers plug the gap. Hungarian infantry. They've been pushed back. There we go. Canister shot hit the the bulk of their infantry in this mass. Same with our quick line. Just drop shells in. They're not going to misfire. Okay, now... You three units push on the left. You units push around this building onto the flank. Yeah, there we go. Starting to push back on the right. Keep quick climb coming. Focus on the Freikorps because they're in a good position. Everyone else will fall in due course. It's just they're just taking a bit of a hammering. It's a great hole blown in the Freikorps line there. Yeah, they've been routed. So all that remains is the 50th Regiment. 50th Regiment of Line. And they are the last target. We've got infantry up on the hill. Excellent shot at them. There's Quick Line coming in. Nope, this is not enough. You men can't withstand. Beautiful. That was quite a fun battle, very mobile, lots of fighting in very different places, attacks, retreats. Nice. I don't know if I would say it was close. Uh, dodgy, for darn sure. And our army is now uh, depleted.
significantly. We've pushed the Austrians back. So now that our men, our men to the west can sweep in and knock out the central German powers. Yeah, and there's, yeah, there's Austrians to the south. They're always going to be a bit of a frustrating problem. Hey, you're going to attack us. That's a bit dodgy because some of our armies, some of our men are not that great. <laughs> uh, hmm, okay. No, looking at the timer because we're pretty much close to an hour and I've, I need to have a bit of a break because that was quite a, that was a long battle. Um, but thanks for watching guys, hope you've enjoyed and I'll see you next time for the defence of Spain uh, after they've uh, attacking the city of Madrid. Cheers everyone.